it looks like a web page hyperlinking to different HTML files. But you'll notice the menu is staying on the screen. And really what's happening is there are two frames, a top frame and a bottom frame. And the HTML pages are playing in the bottom frame. So a frame set is basically a set of files working together to form one whole page. I'm just clicking through the different pages on our basic site. I put a CSS file attached as well. So we'll start with the bottom. And if you notice, I'm clicking on the border and that reveals my frame set. And the actual file only contains reference to the top and bottom, the initial top and bottom HTML files. And as I click in the frames themselves, I can select them. And if I click on the border, I'm selecting the frame set. So there's three files working together initially. The frame set file, which holds the top frame and the bottom frame. So there are three files there. And then this one, two, and three are the different pages we're putting into the bottom frame. So the top frame just has the main menu and the three, four hyperlinks there. The bottom frame has the initial welcome message and then I have my pages. In this case I'm using three pages. And then I add some CSS. So I have my menu for my website. And I'm going to link that to my frame set page. And here are the files in the file panel. Top frame, pages 3, 2, and 1. My external CSS file. My frame set. And my bottom frame. And it's my frame set that I link to my menu. And that's it. So that's what it'll look like. And the next tutorial, we'll take a look at how we built something like that.